After signing one of the best center backs to ever play in world football and one of the best center backs in the world right now, PSG are at the point of terminating the contract of Sergio Ramos because Sergio Ramos has yet to play a single minute of competitive football for PSG since joining from Real Madrid this past summer on a free transfer. Of course, Sergio Ramos is not a spring chicken anymore. He's not young. He is not the quickest center back, but he's still unbelievable at his position in the world. He is only he's still 35 years old. Of course, he's getting up there and it's coming to an end of an era. But PSG are debating on whether or not to terminate the contract of Sergio Ramos after just signing him this past summer, but he's yet to play a single minute. This is crazy. And you're currently having Danny Carvajal, obviously Sergio Ramos' ex-teammate, his ex-international, saying he would welcome Sergio Ramos back full full-heartedly and he'd love to have Sergio Ramos back at the club. Basically, so Danny Carvajal came out saying that it'd be a crazy situation if they terminate his contract but he'd be welcome to having Sergio back at the club of course he would for me once Sergio Ramos is back fit you're gonna have one of the best center backs in the world back in your club and back in your team of course PSG are hurting for center backs with Marquinhos with Tivo Carrer you have some amazing center backs already at the club Kimpembe's there there's some great center backs there but Sergio Ramos brings an element of veteran a leadership he just is one of the best center backs to ever play the game personally for me his scoring shows it his ball control his passing ability his know-how on the field he's just been there and done that PSG don't have many players that have gone out and won trophies at the major level and Sergio Ramos for me once they signed him for me he wasn't a player who was going to walk into the lineup and be there for every single game at his age of course he wasn't going to do that injuries were always going to come to affect him but Sergio Ramos could have been a guy on the bench that's going to be there for a winning mentality, a winning spirit, knowing how to get it over the line. A guy you can sub in late in the game if he's not starting. He was a guy who had winning mentality, a guy who's no, who knows how to win the Champions League. And in that PSG side right now, I look at, I don't see many guys who won the Champions League. I see Georgino Wijnaldum who they signed this year. I've seen Lionel Messi. I don't see many other players who have won the Champions League that side, and they don't have the winning mentality to get that push over the line. They don't have those players with that winning mentality that you need to get over the edge, that you need to stay switched on, and you need for the Champions League. And of course, that's what PSG want. That's why they got Sergio Ramos. That's why they got Lionel Messi, and they want the Champions League. They want that trophy. But for me, Sergio Ramos was that guy that was going to help them, not just on the field, but off the field with his leadership, his mentality and just his winning knowledge and passing on what he's learned over the years that can pump to Marquinhos because those are some of the best center backs in the world for me I still think Sergio Ramos has it but unfortunately this injury has really set him back and of course not being able to play a single minute really does affect and would really really make the PSG owner th- owners think because of course they do have bundles and oodles and oodles of money but Sergio Ramos is on a crazy, ridiculous wage. He's on a crazy contract. Of course, that's what they're ha- going to have to do to bring him into the club. But if they go and terminate this contract, I wouldn't be surprised at all. I would probably agree with them at this moment in time. You have quality center backs already at the club. Yes, you brought Ramos in for a leadership mentality, a winning mentality, and just to help out your other center backs. And of course, to start and to win them the football games. But the fact that he isn't able to play a single minute yet and we're already in November is extremely scary and is costing those PSG owners a lot of money. Personally, for me, I'd probably contract, I'd probably terminate his contract at this moment in time. Why? He's not playing. He's not contributing on the field. He's not living up to the contract he paid. He's, he's getting paid. So why keep him? Of course, other teams are going to go out there and they're going to pay for him. And so do so be it. Let him go out there. Let him... Let him go join another team. Let him go join Real Madrid. But for me, if I was those PSG owners, I would terminate the contract. I know people around the world and rumors are that they shouldn't and they shouldn't terminate his contract just because he's injured. For me, I would. I just don't understand why you'd have a guy that injured for so long and have that ridiculous of a contract when he's 35 years old and he's not a 25-year-old. For me, I sit on the side of I'd probably terminate his contract unless he's back next couple of weeks i'd say terminate it i find it very interesting that some people say keep him you got to understand how much money he's costing the club 
but it is a very interesting topic guys let me know what you guys think down below in the comments if you think Sergio Ramos should stay with PSG and if they should keep him on the contract and keep his wage and eat it and eat it and eat it up but it's a very interesting topic guys let me know what you guys think down below in the comments drop a like it really helps me out in your algorithm and it means the world to me please sub to the channel guys it really helps me out a lot we're pushing for 300 subscribers by the end of the week it would really mean the world to me guys let me know what you guys think down below in the comments drop a like drop a sub and i'll see you guys for the next one peace